hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're all well and having the best week ever happy sunday and welcome to a new video we are up bright and early and we're off to go and get the dreaded nails done i so so wish that you could literally just go to the nail shop drop your nails off leave them with the people and then come back home and then go and pick them up after because the thought of sitting there for over an hour it's not for me not for me so that's what we're doing this morning we're going to fix the nails we thought we could do a bit of a glow up with me for paris video because i've got a lot of stuff to do before i go to paris on sunday so that's what we're doing today we're going to do our tan tomorrow we're going to do our nails today and we're going to sort the hair out plan our outfits pack our case all the good stuff to prep for the holiday so that's what we're doing today it's bright and early it's half nine and i'm going to go get my nails and i'll bring you along show you what i get i'm thinking i'm going to get a pink tip this is what i went for before but they're literally so crusty now um i'm thinking a pink tip with like a silver bow on one th on one finger i'm not really sure which finger yet or what color bow but yeah that's the vibe we're going for i'm going to go for the same shape and my nails look disgusting like i literally don't even want to look at them Ooh. but yeah i'm going to be late it's 22 minutes past my appointment's at half past so let's get going i'll take you to my nail salon it's about five minutes away so not too far but we've got a cozy outfit on it's so cold this morning and do the window wipers but yeah, let's go and get our nails done. I'm so, so excited because there's no better feeling than fresh nails. And especially when they're like, two of them have come off, it just makes me feel really ill. So let's go and get our nails done together. We've got the nails done, guys. They're so, so cute. I'm going to show you in a second when I get in the car, but I'm literally obsessed with them. Um, I don't know why the camera's so blurry, but I'm dying for a wee. So let's get home. But these are the nails. I'm going to do like a big detailed explanation of where I got the inspo and stuff. But these are the nails. They're super cute. I've got like a pink, um, baby pink bow. No, baby pink tip, as you can see, with like a silver bow. And I'm sorry, but I'm literally obsessed with them. Like I love them so much. So really happy with them. But I'm going to head back home and start getting ready for the day and you know sort my shit out but i'm literally obsessed with these let me give you a bit of an in-depth look it's not focusing very well but they look so so cute i've got like a silver bow with baby pink tips to be fair they look a bit white on the camera but i think they're so so cute i'm literally obsessed with them love them so much the sun has just come beaming on me but the inspo is kind of because i'm going to paris on sunday so these are my paris nails but the theme i'm going for for paris is like baby pink and gray so i thought i don't really want to get any like gray nails so i thought why don't I get like a silver bow and a pink tip so i'm really happy with them and yeah i love the shape i always go for oval just because i think it's a bit more i don't know classy i like it a lot so i always go for oval but yeah, I wasn't there too long either, which I'm happy about because I do hate getting my nails done. It's such a task and a chore, but they're done now and they're looking fresh and cute and I just feel so much more put together. It feels really good. So I'm going to head back home and go for a week because I'm dying for the toilet. Um, but yeah, I'm literally in love with them, obsessed with them. Hey guys, we are back home. I feel like, did I show you my nails? I don't really know. But we are about to pack for Paddy, which I'm so, so excited about. Um, ignore the state of me. I'm currently in my dressing gown and I was trying to find a good angle to put you guys to show you the case and me at the same time. And this is where you've ended up on the headboard. So enjoy this view. But I'm currently going to pack, but I thought I'd give you a bit of a close up of the nails that I got. But these are them. Let me see if I can focus it. Literally obsessed with these i'm literally in love with them they're like the perfect thing that i was wanting i didn't want the bow too big i didn't want it too small i think the silver's like the perfect silver and the baby pink is not giving very much pink vibes but it's giving i don't know i don't know it's not as pink as i probably would have wanted but i'm not mad about them so it'll do but look what i've just done to my headphones as well oh sorry bows how cute bought some pink ribbon from amazon um for my hair but i thought why not add them to my headphones as well and i don't know if i've spoken about these before but these are apple dupes and actual apple headphones they're from amazon they're linked in my link tree bio which is in my instagram and tiktok bio so if you want to buy them or check them out then they're linked in there but they're such a good dupe i'm going to say they're more of an accessory than a headphone but they just look cute don't they like i feel like the apple headphones are so pricey for what they are and I'm not about to spend £500 on 
a pair of headphones that I don't even wear. I don't, to be honest, I don't like wearing earphones or headphones anyway. I don't listen to music very often. It's mainly just in the car and things. So yeah, but I'm also on the hunt for a new suitcase. If anyone can tell me where to get a nice suitcase from, I'm swaying between a silver one, a silver kind of trunk one, which I found one on Amazon, which I'm really liking. And then also like a pink, baby pink one too. I don't know which one I want more, but this is the current one that we've got. It's this trip suitcase. It's just a small one. We've only got a small suitcase to take, but I thought we could start packing. As I said, I'm taking this bag as well. And yeah, we need to start packing. I've got my evening outfits, which are super cute. I'm going to give you a sneak peek. But this skirt, I'm sorry, it's from PRT, how stunning. It's a bit revealing because it's a bit, it's like an open kind of situation. And then you clip it um, with this top, which is again, it's stunning. It's like a, well, it's actually meant this way, but I'm wearing it the other way. So it's like backless. And then we've got this, which again, sneak peek, it's not on properly, but it's cute. And then this is like a little skirt as well. And then this is another dress. So that's a sneak peek, but I need to pack. I feel like I've got zero room. Um, I feel like I'm gonna have to squeeze so many things in. The good thing is I'm taking, I think us girls are just gonna not share, like share jackets maybe. Um, and yeah, I don't think we're gonna take many jackets because I don't think we'll need one. As long as we've got like a nice thick one just to put over the top. When we're getting pics and stuff, it's not a massive deal. So yeah, I'm gonna pack my suitcase. I need to pack all of my toiletries as well. I think saying that actually I think we're just going to get them when we get there to save the liquid room but yeah I've got to pack my evening outfits pack my trainers pack heels day outfits pants socks bras everything so let's get packing nothing interesting about this pack with me because it's such a small suitcase so there's not going to be much technique or strategy here so let's just wing it I don't know I also need to take my curler, makeup, perfume, wipes. Oh, there's so much to remember. this is the current situation so this is not what it's going to look like but i just took a cute pic so this is the current situation stuff is just balanced on top because i need to like shove more stuff in but i can't do it until saturday so i've got to put shoes in i've got to put makeup in, not makeup um toiletries and things like makeup brushes um so yeah, I need to wait until obviously I've finished with all those things and can actually pack them. So this is what it's looking like so far. I'm going to give you a quick overview and then I can obviously shut the case and wait until Saturday to finish it because I can't finish it now, which is stressing me out. I feel like I just want to get it over and done with, but that's just not the case. So let me show you what I'm currently working with. Okay, so here we've got our day outfit. So we've got some knits, we've got the bottoms are all together at the bottom and then the tops are all here. Um, we've got accessories on top and then evening outfits underneath. So we've got my earmuffs, the little bag that I'm taking, my gloves, scarf, and then underneath the scarf we've got, sorry, mind the bra, we've got all the evening outfits. Pants and socks are in the corner there. Um, and yeah, that's the situation. I've still got to pack these shoes. Um, my Adidas Sambas and then my heels. But at that current moment i need to put other stuff in so i'm just going to leave those for now or they might have to go in that bag um because i don't think everything's going to fit in here um so yeah that's the current situation so i need to pack my pajamas i'm going to do a checklist now on my phone of what else i need to pack so pajamas shoes makeup toiletries tripod curler hairbrush 
I'm trying to think what else. Obviously passport, which I'm going to put in the bag now because I can just guarantee I'll probably forget. And me, which is a bit annoying, but yeah. Um, sunnies, which there's going to be absolutely no sun, but we still vibe and get the sunglasses out for the trip. And yeah, also how cute is this little bag that I bought? Little pink tiger jute bag. Literally love her, so cute. Um, oh yeah, and these, essential for girls like me. Um, boob original lift and shape type for the girls who can't get away with wearing no bra if you know you know i mean these cost me 15 pounds so they better work but they were from plt um but yeah that is the packing situation currently i will update you on saturday when it's pretty much nearly finished um we've still got a long way to go but we're nearly there we've got the nails done we need to fake tan tomorrow night i need to sort my hair out wash it curl it um so yeah, I'm really, really excited. I can't wait to go now. I'm just buzzing with excitement. Um, I can't believe we're going Sunday. We've got to be up so early as well. Literally so early. But it's going to be so fun and I can't wait. Also, I picked this bag up from... I also got this bag from Vinted. Um, I think it's ASOS, but I just didn't know how I felt about it. I feel like it's really weirdly shaped and it's really big for like an evening bag. Even though she's cute, I feel like I don't... don't like love her that much so i'm gonna leave that bag and take a different black one but she's good for like the shoulder um but she just doesn't really go with my evening outfit so i think i'm gonna leave her behind guys ignore the absolute state of me currently but i just fake tanned and forgot to film any of it go me the whole concept of this video was to you know tan together glow up together um and I fake tanned, as you can see, looking very orange. Ignore the skin. It's not really matching with the spots. It's kind of made them a lot worse. Um, and yeah, completely forgot to film any of it because it's currently, what time is it? Quarter to 11 and I decided to tan at, I think it was like a quarter past 10. So that's what happens when you watch Love Island All Stars and gossip for the last you know how many hours but yeah i forgot to film the tan but i'll definitely show you what it looks like in the morning compared to now i used a bit of a mixture i used sun kissed ultra dark and then st moritz in medium because i wanted like a light tan but also a bit darker for my legs and my stomach and stuff so mixed a bit of both and i feel like it looks really nice so yeah a fake tan ready for paris we've got team on us one day i think tomorrow but yeah gonna pack everything tomorrow i've packed most things as you can see in the corner there oh, we've got some dogs my case is there but i just need to add the last little bits in there um but yeah i'll wake up in the morning show you the tan in the morning and then when it's obviously washed off as well and we can do our hair together because i need to wash it tomorrow morning i've oiled it i use this new oil actually called um i'm not sure what it's called it's called reset hair and scalp oil um which I've got sent for a video that I've got to do. So, yeah, I use that for my hair. So, we'll see how that turns out. Hopefully, it looks good. But, yeah, I'm super excited. I'm going to jump into bed now um, and get some Zeds because I'm super, super tired. We had Mexican for dinner, which was stunning from our local like Mexican, which is new. I think it's been there like a year. But we had nachos with beef and then like a gyros with spicy chicken and then loaded fries. And it was unreal. So... Yeah, but I'm super, super excited. I've got fresh PJs on, Primark Ovs. I've got a new set, not PJs, but it's called, it's like a romper from PLT um, that I'm wearing for Paris, like as my pyjamas, which I'm super excited to wear. Hopefully it's comfy. And yeah, look at these dogs in the corner as well. Super cute. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, I will check in with you guys in the morning when the tan's fresh and she's ready to be washed off. Ooh, that's obviously where I've touched the fake tan, but yeah. Can't wait to see what it looks like. I'm gonna go to I'm gonna go to sleep because I've got a busy, busy day tomorrow. Lots of prep for Paris to be done. So I will see you guys in the morning. Morning, guys. I've just got out the shower. My hair is all wet. I've just washed it. Um, and I used the I think it's called Pump Hair Care. It's this brand here from Australia. Um, they're thickening and um, what is it? Think thickening shampoo and conditioner, I think. Um, but I've recently got this GHD, what's it called? Duet Style Professional 2-in-1 Hot Air Styler. And I really wanted to try it out, so I thought we could try it out together. Um, it looks so nice as well. I'm going to see what you have to do, but I'm sure it's just a blow dryer and straightener in one. This is what 
she looks like very very cute and then i've just applied these products to my hair the dream coat by color wow which is the best um the pump hair care thickening spray and then the ghd sleek talker wet to sleek styling oil which is really good as well which i am trying which is new but yeah just brush my hair and it's very curly so i think i'm gonna curl it for the airport but i thought we could dry it and try this um because i've got really curly pieces as you can see so i don't want to just curl it straight away so i might straighten it and then curl it um so yeah let's put her to use i'm excited just plugged in let's turn her on i'm nervous it's good i think i've switched it on Shine shot, what does that mean? Oh my god. I'm scared. So it's finished. How nice does this look? There's actually a straightener mode as well as like the straightener and hair dryer in one, and I'm actually really impressed with it. I feel like it looks like quite sleek. I'm gonna put a bit of this GHD sleek talk all in just a little tiny bit for a bit more of a shine because my hair gets quite puffy after i dry it but i feel like it's not too bad but yeah i'm really impressed with it i feel like i need to show you in better light but very cute i think i'm gonna curl it for the airport but for now <laughs> for now i'm gonna leave it like this but definitely say it's worth it um what's it called the ghd duet style um but yeah this is the finished hair we're gonna go and take my sister now to the school because she's going on a ski trip i don't know if i mentioned um but she's going on a ski trip today so we're gonna go wave her off and then i've got to get prepping for paris so i'll catch up with you guys a bit later on hi guys it's a little bit later from when i last chatted to you it's currently half past one um but i've just finished curling my hair which is looking a bit not very curly because obviously i straightened it with my new little gadget so oh god it's gonna fall ah that's still hot um but yeah i've kind of briefly curled it like just for now um so i can pack the curlers and then i can obviously curl it in the morning when we leave we've got to leave it like half four tomorrow how early literally cry um but yeah i'm just finishing packing we've got all my shit sorted i've stripped my bed i'm giving my room a bit of a deep clean um but i thought i would just round this video up here because i've got so much to do and i want to get started on the vlog for tomorrow which is going to be so exciting i'm going to do the paris vlog and i can't wait for you guys to watch it and come along to paris with me so yeah i feel like it's been a big build up of me going to paris but the day is actually here tomorrow which is insane i can't believe it's come so quick um but yeah finished curling my hair the rest of the day is kind of just prepping for paris um spending some time with my family and then i'm staying at my friends tonight um because obviously we've got to go up really really early tomorrow so yeah i am really really excited my tan went quite well as well i don't know if i chatted to you about the tan but it went really nice um i feel like it looks a bit weird on camera but in person trust me it looks nice um and then my nails look so cute in my tan too literally love these um but yeah i'm super super excited to get on the plane and go to paris and bring you all along with me so i'm gonna leave this video here and obviously restart it again tomorrow morning bright and early 4 a.m and kind of bring you along on the paris little vacay trip because i'm super excited and i really want to vlog it for you guys and kind of give you an in-depth like what paris is like um places to go places to see what we're wearing and yeah i just want to bring you along so get excited for the paris vlog starting tomorrow I'll chat to you guys next week i think this i think the paris vlog will go up next wednesday so be excited for next wednesday but i hope you all enjoyed this video make sure to give it a massive like and subscribe if you did enjoy and i will see you with a brand new video on wednesday